question came across the desk, when and why should you preheat your metal? Well, preheat involves heating the metal, heating the base metal to a specific design temperature before welding. This could involve an area that surrounds the weld joint or the base metal entirely. There are four primary reasons why we preheat. First reason why we preheat is to slow the cooling rate in the weld metal and base metal. This will produce a more ductile metallurgical structure with more resistance to cracking. Number two, the slow cooling rate provides an opportunity for the hydrogen that may be present to diffuse out harmlessly, reducing the potential for a hydrogen-induced crack. Number three, reduce the shrinkage stresses in a weld and the adjacent base metal. And number four, it can raise some steel's temperature above the brittle fracture, which would occur during fabrication. When determining whether or not to preheat and why we would preheat, we must consider the code requirements, the base metal thickness and chemistry, if the section's in restraint, the ambient temperature, and if the welding consumable is a low hydrogen consumable or not in low hydrogen consumable. If you have a material test report from where you acquired your steel, you can use a preheat and interpass temperature calculator to determine your preheat temperature. Temperature sticks or digital parameters are typically used to address these temperatures. And if you guys are at home welding, <clears throat> uh, it's always safe to throw a little preheat in something. If you're not sure of, of what material you're welding on, you know, you always want to throw a little preheat in there. Good, good thing, four or 500 degrees, that'll help slow that cooling right down. And when you preheat, you want to make sure you're gooding to the thickness of your material. Minimum three inches in all directions. If I got a five inch piece of material, I want to preheat five inches all the way around. Top, bottom, side to side, back to front. If I got a one inch piece, I want to go three inches in all directions. So that's one way to make sure you're getting enough heat into that piece. 